Hello to everyone. Uh, my name is uh, Anthony uh, Voisin. I am in charge of um, international recruitment of the University of uh, Uni La Salle. I will talk about Uni La Salle for uh, 30 minutes. Um, so if you have um, any questions, there is a Q&A session uh, for this um, So uh, let's uh, start. So, uh, what is um, Unilasal? Unilasal is a university uh, based, of course, in, um, in France, and uh, we have four campuses. All our campuses are around Paris. We have uh, one uh, campus in uh, Beauvais, uh, one in Rouen, one in Rennes, and one in Amiens. Each campus has its uh, specialities. Uh, for example, um, Beauvais is famous for um, uh, food and health, uh, agronomy, geolo geology, geosciences, um, and it's more, let's say, like more an American campus. It's outside the city, uh, whereas Rouen, Rennes, and Amiens uh, are uh, urban uh, campuses. Uh, Rouen, mainly where I'm based, is the international campus. It's where most of our international students are, and uh, the one, for example, uh, coming from um, uh, Singapore. Uh, now, we are uh, a grande école. What is a grande école? A grande école in France is technically an Ivy League, but uh, some of the top um, top schools um, in, in France. Uh, all our um, programs are accredited by two ministries, the Ministry of Agriculture or the Ministry of Higher Education. Why? Because we have uh, some programs which are more uh, life science based, so more related to agronomy. And we have some more related to geology, for example, which are more related to um, uh, higher education ministry. Um, what you should know, we have 30 specializations, some in French, some in English. Most of them, of course, in French, in French because we are a uh, university based in France. Um, so 30 specializations, some in robotics, some in digital, some in um, geosciences. What is good is that you can have more career Strong scientific knowledge. That's the um, Then, about um, uh, the university in uh, life and earth sciences uh, in France in terms of, uh, of students. Um, and um, this, um, I wanted also to talk about France. Um, a strong expertise in the field that I'm talking about today. Um, this expertise is, um, for example, in gastronomy, in um, agriculture, also in, um, in uh, robotics. And even if you do a program fully taught in English, you will learn French. And learning French is also an added advantage um, in an international market when you look for a job. That's also something to keep in mind. And French will um, be a stronger and stronger um, language. I just made a small um, focus also on um, uh, Normandy and uh, our campus in one where it's most of our program taught in English are here. Um, if you have watched a uh, movie, for example, Harry Potter, uh, you'll find this kind of uh, medieval city, kind of medieval uh, mood. Um, the region Normandy is um, famous uh, for many things, but uh, we were also glad that last year it was um, in the top 10. Uh, region to um, uh, visit by the Lonely Planet, and uh, it's uh, 43,000 students in all the um, different universities, so that's um, um, a university city, let's say. And one hour from Paris, most of our campus are one hour from Paris, so if you want to take to go to the airport and to visit uh, Europe, you have one in Beauvais, for example, and, and you have one in Paris, so that's really fast, so that's um, uh, really um, a plus. Then, um, about Unilasal. So, Unilasal is a global um, network. Lasal um, is an um, international network. You even have a Lasal High School in, in Singapore. Um, you, or we are currently also the largest network of education. We have one million students all around the world which are part of a network. Uh, you have some in the Philippines. You maybe know the Lasal in the Philippines. You have Lasal in the US. 
uh, and also in South America. For example, last year I went on my holidays in Peru and I met people who were of Lassa Latin work. So, um, but maybe for you, you maybe say it's irrelevance, but no, because when you look for a job, if you have a name which sounds more famous and um, uh, you have it on your uh, resume, that's also a small plus, but that's also um, um, uh, something uh, quite good. We have a last time network, but we also have other partners uh, all around the world. Um, um, in the US, for example, with Michigan State University, uh, Chicoutini University in Quebec. Um, so there are really uh, many possibilities to uh, also go abroad in the, in the different program. Just a small example also of um, the La Salle Alumni Network. For example, uh, you have François Hollande who was in, um, in, uh, in a French high school, uh, in a La Salle High School in France. You have Jim Kenney who uh, was mayor of uh, Philadelphia. You have Toshiki Kaifu, uh, prime minister of Japan uh, back in the days in uh, 1989. Uh, also did um, a La Salle University. So that's a strong network also with, uh, with quite some uh, famous people, let's say. Um, now let's talk about uh, academics. Let's go more uh, deeply into the subject. What are the program taught in English mainly? Um, so we have a BSc and an MSc International Sustainable Agribusiness and Food Engineering. So that's a program fully taught in English. That's uh, first in France in the field of life science. Um, after three year, after five years, or if you join in year two or year three, you will be uh, bilingual or even uh, trilingual. Here uh, we go, let's say, from uh, the fork to the plate. When I say this, for example, you can work more on the soil, or you can work more on the topics around uh, industry, about um, uh, sustainable uh, food, sustainable industries. Uh, related to um, life science. You maybe think um, agronomy or life science is not such a strong topic, but um, if we think about the crisis of the COVID-19, one of the only sector who was able to, um, to get more money to be stronger is this uh, topic of food industry and um, agronomy. Uh, there is food, but there is also what you are wearing um, uh, on you. For example, textile is also made of of agronomy of, of plants, so you can work on this. Uh, also, there are biomaterials, that's new topics, for example, uh, cars of the futures. Uh, our rich research uh, researcher work on this, for example, on car made of uh, biomaterials. So more sustainable um, a car, even uh, what you have in front of you, for example, your desk and something like this, is made of wood or other materials. Um, uh, where you need some engineer to know um, the different uh, topic around this. Um, so, I already kind of more or less talked about the ag and food challenges, but to sum up, we are going to be more and more around the world. Uh, so, the number of resources are going to be less and less. So, our engineer need to find solution that we are able to feed the world, number one, uh, feed enough, and number two, um, Feed also with quality because we also realize that what you eat has a real strong impact on your um, health and also for sport men, for example, also on your performances and things like this. And also, the topic is respect the earth and the um, environments. Uh, for example, uh, we work on um, urban agriculture and green cities, how we um, can reduce um, uh, global uh, warming with um, with a, a strong policy on the plants and also of green uh, cities. Now, just more about the program. So um, that's more the model of French uh, engineering. The first three years, you are going to focus more into uh, mathematics, physics, uh, chemistry, uh, biology, uh, to have a strong expertise, scientific expertise, but not only this, you also have classes in geopolitics, um, also in languages. In the last two years, it's where you specialize. For example, you say, um, I'm more interested in informatics, but I also like biology. So you can take the specialization, um, agriculture and food data management. For example, one of um, our alumni, which is now one of the top 100 millionaires in, um, in France, has developed a software related to uh, to um, agriculture and agronomy. Uh, 
Um, or you say, let's say, for example, um, Singapore um, has many topics around uh, green cities, how to make the city more green. So really, Singapore is already an advanced city on, on this, but um, how can we make better models? I like architecture, I like biology and environments. How can I manage? You have this program also uh, fully taught in English, or um, let's say, uh, you say, I want to be more an entrepreneur. We also have one specialization more into entrepreneurship. You see in, in purple uh, down the, the slide, you see that there are internships uh, every year. That's also something important. You can do your internship in France or abroad, and it's giving you more and more um, experiences. Um, in orange in the slide, you have also one week study trip on the first um, three years. You go, for example, to Brussels, to the European Commission, to see um, how it works for the European Commission around environmental topics, around agriculture topics, and like this. And in green, in year three and in year four or five, you can do semester abroad uh, in a partner uh, university. So let me show you uh, our majors. So you have 17 majors. Now we even have more major in the, in the topic. And you can do double degrees in France or around the world, let's say. You say, I want to add um, more business um, a diploma into my engineer uh, degree. You can go, for example, to Odensia Business School. You say, OK, I'm also interested in um, going abroad and to have a double degree with, um, let's say, a, a university from the Netherlands, so Wageningen University, which is also one of the top universities. So you will have a degree of Wageningen and a degree of um, Universal. So a French degree and a degree from a partner university. So that's also a plus when you want to work abroad and in terms of recognition also of your degrees, um, make uh, paper a bit um, easier. So now what are the master taught also in English? So we have uh, currently four master uh, taught in, in English. Uh, so the number one I already told you about, that's the urban agriculture. If you have a background in um, architecture, uh, background in biology, in life science. Uh, here, so we talk about, um, we try to find urban innovation strategy and sustainable environment development. And to, to try to up, um, to make it stronger um, in terms of the buildings and um, the uh, built environment. Number two is the data management in food agriculture. Uh, here you are, you are at the cutting edge of technology um, agriculture and food industry, but really, you know that data is playing a bigger uh, role um, on our everyday life now. Uh, but also in this field, it's getting more and more uh, strong and there are many, many um, new opportunities in the field, in the industry, for example. Uh, number three is a double degree with the Rennes School of Business, that's the Sustainable Management and Eco-Innovation uh, Program. Uh, here you will um, work for uh, companies um, to make their policy more sustainable. Let's say we talk about a company like Coca-Cola. Uh, how you make Coca-Cola more sustainable in terms of their production. Um, at a global level, you will check where the, um, comes from the um, water comes from, how we make the um, uh, strategy more sustainable and things like this, and the value of the organization, all right? Uh, and the master plant breeding, which is an Erasmus Mundus program. Uh, here we work more on the crop uh, improvements and new crop varieties. Uh, for the first, first three programs, it's a uh, one year and a half program, you have one year academic and six month internship. Whereas the last one, it's um, uh, two years more uh, academics, and then you finish, of course, with also an internship in the last uh, semester. So that's really a mix of academic and uh, practice. That's something really uh, also important for us. Up. In terms of careers, where are our uh, uh, alumni working now? In terms of positions, they are um, most of them in technical and sales at 29%. Uh, what does it mean? It means that compared to, for example, let's say a business school, So we have um, we have so the technical um, uh, parts with a strong engineering knowledge, 
and the business uh, knowledge into the technical and sales. Okay. For, um, sorry, Frederick, I think I hear you. Frederick, can you turn off your microphone? Um, and uh, we have position at 28% consultant and manager. For example, uh, you are consultant for a global organization, um, which is taking more care of the um, global warming. You are consultant, you make uh, analyze, for example, based on data and uh, things like this. Then you can also be a manager. Most of our uh, alumni students have already they finished after the engineering program. They have a team of already three or four people um, after uh, graduating. Uh, some of them in the industry and some of them in the marketing and in agriculture. What is important to know is that it's um, really a uh, large um, uh, spectrum of uh, possibilities. For example, last time I came to Singapore, I met one of our alumni, uh, our alumni. he's working in the, um, in the pharmacy, uh, pharmacy uh, industry. Now, um, there are two possibilities. Depends on your wish, you can work for a top company or create, create your startup. Let's say, for example, you know Danone, maybe you know Perfume, Guerlain, Guerlain uh, Nestle, or for bank. So you can work, depends what's your idea behind, if it's more um, your wish to have a really strong salary, or if you want to create your startup. Um, we have now more than um, 1,000 partners uh, for internship, for uh, apprenticeship for um, um, also um, agro, what we call um, a duo day. For example, you spend one day on your first year with um, a former student. So that's um, a strong um, network which will really help you uh, to have a strong um, uh, to have a strong job. For example, also in Rouen we have. Uh, Ferrero, which is, um, you maybe know the brand Nutella, so Ferrero is technically based in uh, Rouen, where I'm currently. Um, so engineer a passport to find a job in France or abroad. So um, within six months, 85% of our students uh, have a job, and in one year, all our students have a job. Uh, why do we have uh, such a high um, percent? Um, it's because we have this strong connection, as I said before, with the companies, and our uh, engineering program is um, has it has internship inside. We are really connected with the former students, the alumni, and the last point is that in Europe, mainly in France and in Germany, there is a lack of um, engineers. Uh, therefore, that's really something which um, is important for you. And as I said. That's um, a field, a sector, which is uh, always strong and even you know, getting uh, stronger. Uh, what are the admission requirements? It really depends. If it's for the bachelor uh, program, it will be more, of course, a high school degree. If you take, for example, the Master of Science in Data in Urban Agriculture, uh, it will be more bachelor in biology in agriculture, in agriculture, architecture for urban agriculture and green cities, business if you take more of a sustainable management and organization. So it will be depending on your MSc. So if you have more questions, you can also uh, ask it um, after. Um, then on your um, English level, level, we ask for TOEIC, TOEFL, or IELTS. Um, and it's a two step procedure. Uh, so you have an online application, you send your, your application. If you are shortlisted, you are invited for um, interview. Uh, and then the interview, you met the jury, you can uh, show your motivation, explain why you, have, um, you chose this program, and this kind of things. Then when to apply, we have several sessions, uh, November, January, March, in June. So that's a rolling application. Then about student life. So there are two main topics which are important at Universal. That's your academic development, but also your personal development. That's the LaSalle um, idea of um, uh, development. Uh, so we have um, integration week. You have, when you arrive as an international student, you have a French buddy 
you have someone ready to show you around, things like this. We guarantee housing on the campuses, so you don't have to worry about this. That's sometimes a um, hard topic for international students. Um, and you can play a role in uh, big events which are managed by the students. For example, the, the gala or the overlay, which is a, a big rugby tournament. That's one of the biggest rugby tournaments um, in France. Now, uh, for the case of one, it's 42 clubs. Well, if I take all our campuses, that's more than 100 stations. So if you play music, if you, um, uh, if you play chess, if you want to be part of the international association, if, for example, you see that there is one club that we don't have yet and you would like to develop, that's possible. Uh, for example, the um, Sustainable and Environmental Club started uh, last year um, and you also have like more funny uh, clubs like the cheese club and things like this so if you see more uh, funny things uh, feel free also to to create your your own uh, clubs facilities everything is around the campus uh, you have a gymnasium you can be you can do horse riding you have rugby football tennis court we have uh, two people in charge of um, student life so you can go to them and ask more questions and uh, see what is more matching with what you want um, at no extra uh, cost. So what are our, uh, sorry, what are our uh, differences? So number one, that's our transdisciplinary approach. So we go, for example, as I said, from a strong scientific knowledge, uh, biology to a marketing or business uh, programs or um, um, specialization. So that's really up to you. Number two is LaSalle Learning in the Collective. Most of the programs that you will do and are also in groups. You work a lot in groups. Why, why this? Because when you will work for a company, you will spend a lot of time being a manager and uh, trying to find solution together as an engineer because not to forget, an engineer is someone who finds a uh, solution uh, and for our case, a uh, sustainable um, solution. Number three, learning by doing. Here, for example, you see our students who are in uh, geology. For example, they go in the mountains, they really go on the ground, really to learn things. As I said, for example, we go to, you go to Brussels with your class uh, really to study um, how the organization are working and things like this. So that's not only um, programs in online class, that's also doing a lot of practice. Number four, it's a worldwide network and let's say a brand. That's the, the LaSalle uh, University and the LaSalle network. Uh, you, you probably know it also um, in, the, in Singapore with under over name, I think in Singapore, it's St. Joseph uh, High School. Um, for uh, Philippines, you maybe know De La Salle University, which is um, also a strong university in, in the region. Um, so as I said before, that's also a plus when you go to the US, that's a strong network. That's not only our uh, French network, that's also an international network, which can really help you when you, when you want to have an international career. Uh, then about scholarship and uh, fund. So uh, scholarship, most of our program have scholarship. It's a maximum of 75% on nutrition fees. Um, it's merit and social based uh, scholarship. How does it work? You apply for the program, you have an interview. If you are shortlisted, you can apply for a scholarship and there is a new selection for the scholarship. And then there is a decision to know which kind of scholarship you have or you do not have depending on your um, merits or social uh, situation. Uh, then what's the living cost in um, our cities? So we have, we are about six, 650 euros per month. That's quite interesting for example for one which is one hour from Paris. Uh, we, sometimes it's even less for some students because we guarantee housing which are a bit cheaper than the private market. So that's also really uh, um, a plus. Uh, you can also, when you do your internship in France, if you do your internship in France, all the internship are, uh, are paid. So here, uh, to um, conclude, um, to finish, um, so here is um, my contacts, 
um, you have my emails, you can ask any question. Uh, we'll do soon also some uh, live uh, chat sessions. Um, so you have the Q&A session just after if you want. Um, and you you can contact me uh, also on WhatsApp, on my email. You can find us, uh, us also on our different network. I can connect you also with some of our international students if you want to know more details, um, how, is, how it is to be an international student in um, uh, Unilacel in France. Uh, so thank you very much. And um, if you have more questions, then we can switch to the Q&A session. Thank you very much for your attention.